Welcome back. Let's uh, get right into this. Hold on. Okay. So we last left off, if I remember correctly, we killed Papyrus. And we just, uh, we're in the waterfall now, I believe. Let's see, I want to see what I have actually. Okay. 44 kills. Oh, oh yeah, I have a bunch of stuff in my, um... Wait, what happens if we call her? I have a bunch of stuff in my box. Okay. This is a box. You can put an item in or... Yeah. Let's see what we got. Oh yeah, I put everything in here because I was doing so well. Alright. One thing I wanted to know too. Oh yeah, I already did this, I think. I wanted to know if Temi Village was still available. I think I already went, yeah, I already went there. Available after you've, uh, you know, started the genocide route. Oh, okay. I was like, is she normally does that? I know there's no papyrus, but... I mean, I guess we could just fight right now, you know? Oh, wait a minute. <clears throat> 18, I have to kill 18 people before this point. Alright, let me, uh... Wait, did I mess it up already? Yo. Did you see the way she was staring at you? That was awesome. I'm so jealous. She was just standing there waiting forever. <laughs> and then you just... Come on. Let's go watch her beat up some bad guys. Oh wait, no, I don't, I don't, yeah, the music sounds like it's still in Genocide. Yep, 18 left. The four bridge seeds align in the water. Okay. Yeah, because I thought you had to do the kills before. Oh, she's smiling when she runs into a person to kill before you encountered the boss, but we're not going to fight her until much later. Bye, Aaron. Those are... Um, is there something here? I don't think so, but I don't remember. Oh yeah, you need four in a row. So never mind. What's this? Oh, okay. Alright. I don't think there's anything to do here. Anything that involves a genocide route anyways. We have to kill 18 creatures here. Before we fight undying for it to count. Oh wow, it just said spare. Or their their name turned yellow. I wonder if that does it in the normal one. If you could just beat them down until they uh want you to spare them. Skip the dialogue. Wait a minute. Okay, this is just running away. This isn't the fight just yet. I 
know why uh, Kara would run. I wonder how many more uh, areas there are until we fight fight her. I feel like we're very close to the actual battle with her. I've only killed a couple people. Yo, did you see that? Undying just touched me. I'm never washing my face ever again. Man, are you unlucky. If you were standing just a little bit to the left, yo, don't worry. I'm sure we'll see her again. Oh yeah, we'll save. Yeah. This cheese has been here so long, a magical crystal has grown around it. It's stuck to the table. Strangely silent. Is Temi Village in the waterfall? I think it is, right? The ancient glyphs have been painted over with a list of 21 different flavors. Nope. Okay. This just tells me to look at the wall, right? No. Can't look through it. After the waterfall is the hotlands, so we could easily distinguish the difference. It's a pair of ballet shoes. Will you take it? Got the ballet shoes. Weapon 7. Incredibly dangerous. Um, let's put them on. And now let's... Okay. Yep. Okay. It's so quiet. All the fun has been drained from this game. Oh shit, yeah, that's what the ballet shoes do, don't, isn't it? Yeah, they're shaking. Slightly. Oh, damn it. There we go. No echo flowers. Oh wait, is this the... Oh no, this is where the um... That one guy is. He's under the water. Never mind. Almost. Her head just came off? It's pretty, uh, creepy. Just going to do the piano. Since, yeah, that's just a meme, right? The dog. I want to keep the umbrella, though. Yo, you got an umbrella? Awesome. Let's go. Oh, he does it, too. <laughs> 
Can I kill monsters while he's with me? Man, Undyne is so cool. She beats up bad guys and never loses. If I was a human, I would wet the bed every night, knowing she was going to beat me up. Haha. <laughs> So one time, we had a school project where we had to take care of a flower. The king, we had to call him Mr. Dreamer, volunteered to donate his own flowers. He ended up coming to school and teaching the class about responsibilities and stuff. That got me thinking, yo, how cool would it be if Undyne came to school? She could beat up all the teachers. If all, are all the teachers uh, humans? Uh, maybe she wouldn't beat up the teacher. She's too cool to ever hurt an innocent person. You mean, uh, innocent monster? Wait, where'd he go? Oh, I was, like, speeding past him. Oh, you could stop him. By holding the down button. Yo, this ledge is way too steep. Yo, you wanna see Undyne, right? Put up your umbrella and climb on my shoulders. Ow. Yo, try being a little less rough. <laughs> anyway, I'll look for another way up later. Thirteen left. Yeah, we're still good. See if there's anything we could find. Yeah. How many times did we encounter Undyne? Like five, six? Oh, wow. Okay, yeah, no, we're just running. Oh! Fucked up. This one's a lot easier to dodge. I'll just have to do a stop. Oh shit. Just the edge? No. Okay, there she is. It's getting a lot faster. I must be going the right way then if it's going faster. Okay, yeah. There we go. That was it, right? I think so. Okay. Remember there was a cutscene that's supposed to happen. Damn, it's pretty loud outside. I don't know if you guys can hear it. It's a lawnmower. It's like raining too. I don't know why there was a lawnmower outside if it's raining. It sounds like it came from over here. Oh! You've fallen down, haven't you? Are you okay? Here. Get up. Miruku. Huh? That's a nice name. My name is... Alright, we're gonna stop here. I lost track of time. Pick this up in the next one and try to get this done. Uh, thanks for watching, guys. See ya. Bye.